Hello, fellow readers. So today we are reviewing The Help, Catherine Stockett. And apparently she was writing the book while she was giving birth. And they were trying to tell her, stop writing, you're giving birth. <laughs> no, this, this, can, this, this can't wait. That's a story in itself. Loved this book when I read it. It was during the times where there was discrimination against races. This is unfair. This story is about black people working for white people as maids. Three main characters. Minnie. Mm, that one's amazing. She's so funny. Skeeter is good too. Her job is to work at a journalist. So she asked to interview maids that worked in certain households and they were too scared to because it's like, uh, if I told my story, I have lots of lots of stuff to tell. But it's like, if I do, it would probably cost my job. So yeah antagonist in this book is Hilly, the meanest person and like controls everything. <laughs> At the end it's so funny she gets like roasted. Minnie worked for Hilly's mother. Aww. Sorry I just looked at a certain page. I say Abilene and she says Aby. And I say love. She say love. I say May Mobley and she say Aby. <laughs> so cute. Abilene worked for Elizabeth, Hilly's friend. Mae Mobley is Elizabeth's first child and Abilene was sort of more of a mother to Mae Mobley, which is really sad because in the end, um, read the book. Anyway, you'll understand. Oh, there's a very interesting bit in the book. So the thing is, in the movie and in the book, this high incident with Hilly and Minnie, there is a swear word, but it's hilarious cool it's fun. Minnie and Abilene are part of the writing of the book and telling their stories um, and Minnie says that they should put this funny pie incident into the story so that they're safe because there's no way Hilly would say that that bit was about her. The story was told marvelously. You sort of feel like you're in it and you like understand. You'll feel this is wrong, discrimination. Oh, such disappointment. Oh, this is cool. Oh my goodness, they did that. Oh yeah, and it's like, oh yes. Oh, this is amazing. Yes, you got payback. You didn't see that coming? <laughs> it's like, yeah, so the ending. It was sad, actually. So like, I guess it's unexpected. It's sad, but unexpected. Like the people in the story don't exactly get what they think they want but they actually do get what they really want so it's it's a sad but it's a good ending and so just reinforce why we shouldn't discriminate they're really nice people in the story were really cool they were amazing and it's like why are the people white people so mean to them they're so funny you're like missing out and i was like discrimination is wrong <laughs> so yeah that's my little review and this book I highly recommend it has the juice, it has the fun, it has the sweet, it has the sour, it has the coolness. It's a, it's a meal book, it's a food book, it's a book you'll love. <laughs> it enhances, it enriches your soul of how karma comes back at you in the end. Anyway, it also has <clears throat> chocolate pie. If you have read this book and watched the movie, Please hit that like so you let me know and tell me what you think about it in the comments. Tell me what you think about this book. Tell me what you disliked. Tell me what you, tell me what you loved. <coughs> and subscribe if you want to see more of our content. Our mother really wanted us to be able like to read. So she would have presents, but we had to earn it. We had to earn it. So we had to read books in order to earn it. I wasn't much of a reader when I was younger. I'd fake reading certain books by going skip, skip, skip. and it's like oh i've read this bit so can i um can i get the and then <laughs> and then my mother one time got suspicious and she asked me questions about a certain bit where that was up to in certain bits of the book and then i couldn't answer the question so i had to lie or make it up but either way it didn't work out and she was like you haven't been reading the book have you and i was like no. <laughs> so, yeah, it was funny. When we read when we were younger, we, we read along with audio, which I love doing. And the audio with this is good. 
you know, like a young kid reading a thick book. And when you read with an audiobook, it, it brings much more... Because, I mean, when you hear it and you're reading it at the same time, I feel that you take in more information. Because if you're just reading it, your mind might wander. And if you're listening to it, your mind might also wander. But when you actually have to listen and read at the same time, you get the story a bit better, in my opinion. Listening as well can also help the kid be like, how do you pr oh, you pronounce that word that way, okay. 